everybody, welcome to Yesenia Plans. In this channel, we talk about organization, budgeting, my graduate school journey, and so much more. Today, we're going to be talking about doing your nails at home and how that could actually save you a lot of money. So I decided to invest in getting this gel nail polish collection. It's a kit. It brings different colors, a total of 18 to be specific, and I'm super excited to use it. I haven't used it yet, but this kit has really good reviews. My nails right now, they're super long. I have to file them, but usually my nails grow really fast, and I'm excited to use the colors. The kit comes with a top coat and also a base coat which are both of the ones that are here in the bottom. I'm gonna show you the actual bottle so you have an idea, but I'm super excited. I also decided to purchase the UV LED lamp, which is in the back. It comes with a charger. This was a separate purchase. So both of these items I actually bought at Amazon, and I believe the total cost wasn't more than $60, maybe less. And honestly, when you get a Manny and Petty, uh, it, it adds up. Honestly, the price for the gel nail polish collection was definitely reasonable for the amount of pieces that you get, which is a total of 18, and they're high quality nail polish based on the reviews. Always read your reviews when you're about to purchase an item. Something that I think that is important about making purchases you want to make sure that you're making an investment and that you're getting good quality items. So you have to do your research, whether you're buying nail polish, a car, buying a house, <laughs> renting. You want to make sure that whatever you're getting yourself into is worth what you're paying, if that makes sense, right? So in this case, I will link both of the items and the exact price for both items. I'm super excited to use them. I will show you how my nails come out in the last portion of this video, so stay tuned. I was already doing my nails at home before this kit because of COVID-19, but the thing is that I was using regular nail polish. The thing with regular nail polish, depending on the brand and the type, is that it will probably last you a week, but it might not last you two to three weeks, right? Gel usually lasts you two weeks, which is nice, especially since the holidays are approaching us, like Thanksgiving, Christmas. I don't want to go out. COVID is still out there, <laughs> and I'm trying to stay safe. And I think that this is a good investment. And by buying this and doing my nails at home, I'm saving money, I'm staying safe at home, and I also have a lot of options. I could do my nails whenever I want to, at whatever time. I don't necessarily need to make an appointment, wait, have a line, and all that fun stuff that you actually have to deal with when you go to the salon. In addition to that, when you go to the salon, you also have to, or you should, leave a tip. So in reality, you're saving so much money by doing this because you're also saving money on the commute. My salon is not that far from my house, but I'm saving time and money, so this is definitely an investment. I am super, super excited to see the result, and I will provide you with further information as to if I liked it or not. Um, I will provide you with my honest feedback when I paint my nails and letting you know if I liked uh, the end result or not. Definitely follow me on social media. My Instagram account is Yesenia Plans. I will probably post a review there as well and more pictures with the final results. So I'm going to get down to business. Hi everybody, so this is the UV lamp. This is a setup where I have it. You want to make sure that you have it in a table or location which you don't mind getting dirty. I'm probably going to put some paper here so it doesn't get that dirty and it doesn't get messy. But overall, the timer for this machine is five seconds, 30 seconds, and also 60 seconds. So depending on what you're doing, you want to make sure that your nails are dry. So I would recommend the 60 or 30 second interval. 
I'm going to use it now. It comes with a little charger, so you want to find an outlet that's near you as well. And I'm super excited, you guys. Let's get this rolling. I wanted to show you the setup before I start. Okay, guys, I'm going to turn on the UV LED. It's on. Turned on the UV LED application, and the first step is I'm going to use the top coat. So let me open it and use the top coat so you could all see. After I do the top coat, I will probably leave the top coat on for 60 seconds because I would want it to dry fully. So I think it would be a good idea for me to leave the top coat for 60 seconds. This is my first time doing the gel. I feel like I'm using too much of the top coat, but then again, I want them to last me. I'm leaving my arm there for 60 seconds. Okay, that feels weird. Not burning my nails, but it feels weird. I guess this really does heat up. I'm going to leave my nails here for 60 seconds. I think the machine turns off by itself after the top coat. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to after apply the color. For the color, I might do two coats. Okay, so it's done. Could you see it? I think I have low battery, so we're going to try to finish this. I want you to see the color and I'm excited. Oh my gosh, let's do this. Let's do this. Hey guys, so I'm sorry my camera died on me. I thought I had enough battery. Clearly it didn't. So I'm going to show you the end result because when I was trying to film, my nails were so wet. Look at this, how nice. Like when you feel the nail polish, you could totally tell it's gel. It's my first time doing it, so it's not perfect, but let me walk you through the process. So this was a total of two or three coats, and the reason why I did three coats or two was because I wanted the color to come out and pop up, so that's why I did that. But you could use two coats instead of three. The first thing that you want to do is you want to put your top coat and you want to put your top coat carefully in all of the nails. You have a total of four buttons, one to turn it on. So if you click on, you're gonna see that the light turns on and then off to turn it off. We're not gonna use it, so we're going to have it off. But pretty much it has a five second interval, 30 second and 60 second. Ideally, after you do your quote, your first quote, you want to put quote, oh my God, I'm thinking of quotes, coat. After you do your first coat, you want to do 60 seconds so it dries up. After you do your coat and the coat is dry, then that's when you get your color. And this is a color that I use. After you apply your coat, then you want to use a gel polish. This is the brand that I'm using. I'm going to link everything under if you want to get it. This is my first time using it, and honestly, I love it. I do need to clean my nails. I think that was the thing that I could improve on for next time. The set brings a total of 18 different colors, and you're able to purchase different sets. So that's great. Obviously, the least amount of coats that you use, the longer the color will last you. The bottle really isn't that big. Let me tell you what it says, the quantity that it brings. So it's 6 ml, 0.1 fl ounces. This is how they look, and you have a total of 18. So for the price, it's really good, and for the quality of the nail polish, it's great. I'm hoping that it lasts me two weeks. I'll let you know. After you finish applying that amount of coats that you want, then your final step would be the top coat. And this is the bottle for the top coat. It has a different color. So remember, your purple is your starting coat and your blue is a finishing. So this is a great product, especially if you're trying to save money. I'm all about saving money, especially nowadays with COVID-19. You want to stay home. You could just do your nails from the comfort of your home. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this video and that it gave you an idea on how to do your nails at home. Thank you, thank you so much for watching. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure to subscribe. I post videos every Sunday and I try to post throughout the week. So hit that notification bell so you're notified when I put a new video. 
Thank you so much and see you next time.